I thought I'd make a quick vlog. Another one. And... Now nah, these glasses aren't sitting straight. They were. Okay. Anyway. Uh, so, I want to talk a little bit about just what I've been through in life when it comes to my mind. Uh, you know, I did have a break at three and I had problems that weren't as pronounced all the way until about 20, 20, between about 23. And then it became uh, very severe. I don't know. I mean, what I'm trying to say is that I see people out there who may or may not have issues. And I think to myself, yes, I was once in their shoes. And, you know, I'm still not whole, but I have faith that I will come out of it. And I'm far better than I was before. You know, better off from with my thinking clearly and stuff. And, I, you know, I just, I want to do something to make a difference for people going through, you know, I don't know, PTSD, any kind of mental, any kind of mental uh, issues. And, you know, because only through the grace of God could I have escaped everything they threw on me. Only through the grace of God is Marissa sane. Only through the grace of God. Because she was supposed to be insane her entire life. Only through the grace of God. <clears throat> so, um, and if it happened for me, it can happen for other people. Through prayer through medication, through um, faith, through therapy. Uh, what else? I mean, there is so much, so much prayer. A lot of prayer, not only from, your, from yourself, but from people around you. If you are going through a mental disorder, then please ask for prayers. There are sites online, this is me now, there are sites online where you can just, you know, ask for prayers. And you, you can be anonymous. You don't have to say your name. But just tell them what you want them to pray about. And many, many, many people will pray for you. Prayers count. Trust and have faith. Because you can get out of it too. Yes. And there were so many mornings... When I woke up, well, so many nights when I went to bed and I said, how do people wake up and feel normal and and feel normal throughout the day? I don't know how people do that, you know, because I had lost so much of my, uh, of my feeling normalness. I mean, it's just, I don't know. I was just out of it. And, uh, but now, you know. I'm not whole yet, but at least I know I feel more normal than ever before. And Marissa's very normal. She's just not whole yet. Okay, so, yes. So, I feel normal now. And, I'm, you know, just thinking back to the days gone by when I was really suffering, it's I couldn't, I mean, I don't know. It was just like some fuzz there and just blocking, like, I don't know. It was just terrible. But if you are suffering from a mental disorder, you need to get therapy. You need to get medication, the right medication and the right dose. And you need to ask for prayers. Sanity is possible. Living a normal, normal life where you are sane and happy is possible. 
It doesn't matter what kind of disorder you have. It is possible to recover. Okay. And I want to make a difference. And you have made a huge difference. I have? Yes, you have. Okay, so <clears throat> we'll get into that later. With I'll talk about to my men about that. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I just want to make a, a an impact because it's so it's such a horrible illness to not be able to think right and to have all these people make fun of you, you know. And it is true, people are very cruel, and they do make fun of people with mental disorders. Marissa was made fun of and still is made fun of by most people here in Cleveland. Mm hmm So, yeah. I don't know. I mean, NAMI, awesome. I don't know what other, uh, needy meds. Yes, needy meds. Those are the two main resources besides the clinics that I went to uh, for meds and therapy and uh, to see the psychiatrist. Those are the two main resources I used in my lifetime. But they were very helpful. Very, very helpful. Yes, they were extremely helpful. Um, so... You know, and to think that organizations like that are out there, you know, and we have everything on your website. Okay, so there's the resources are on the website. Okay. <clears throat> okay, well, for everyone out there who is suffering from any kind of mental disorder, I'm sorry. I know. I know. Poor baby. I know maybe you don't want people to feel sorry for you, but I have empathy at least because I know what it's like. I've been there, and I hope you ask for prayers, and I hope you get the right medication and a good psychiatrist and a therapist you trust. Okay, and on that note, I'm going to end this vlog, and I'm going to say I hope everybody watching has a great evening tonight and a great day tomorrow and things go your way. Alright, bye.